Hey guys, there has been an ongoing debate on whether or not one should post about their bay on social media. I personally have friends that do and those that don't, and their relationships have either been going strong or have gone up in flames. After doing some research, I found that there are definitely pros and cons when it comes to posting about your relationship on social media. So here are 15 reasons why posting about your relationship can make it or break it. For the pros. 1. Your friends and family who are long distance can see who your bae is. You are inviting others to be part of your life and posting can make it easy to tell everyone who this special person is that makes you happy. 2. It shows your partner that you're proud to show them off. This is great if words of affirmation such as certain adjectives are used to describe your boyfriend or girlfriend, if these are their top love languages. Three. You are able to scroll back and use hashtags on posts to remember fun memories. 4. You find ultimate satisfaction and feel that posting about your relationship will strengthen the bond even more. 5. You want to indirectly tell potential suitors that you are no longer on the market. 6. The world can celebrate big milestones that both of you reach together. 7. You can help promote each other if you have a business that correlates with your relationship. Think Chip and Joanna Gaines. Hashtag power couple. Now for the cons. 8. Studies show that frequently posting about your bae is a sign of insecurity as an individual and or you are codependent in your relationship. And they also imply trouble and overcompensation of an unhappy relationship. 9. It is a way to convince others to convince yourself that your relationship is happy and healthy when it really isn't. 10. Love language type posts that aren't for special occasions will come off as insincere and only for attention. 11. You are feeding other people's curiosity of your love life. Thus, you are setting yourself up for judgments, jealousy, and criticism. 12. Unfortunately, if you break up, you'll have to go through the trouble of deleting beautiful photos and then explaining to everyone why you're no longer together. 13. When posting too much of the two of you, people will feel like you are only using it for external validation. If your boo isn't into social media and you are, or vice versa, one of you may start feeling undesired. 14. Posting a lot can reveal your narcissistic character. You may even come off as psychopathic if you are constantly commenting and posting on social media about how perfect your relationship seems to be. 15. Sometimes relationships that last need privacy. Other times, it is a good way to keep it going. For example, I once dated a man, let's call him Jack Frost. We took pictures, but he never posted them on any of his accounts. I thought it was strange after several months of dating and he was pretty active on social media. My intuition told me something wasn't right. Long story short, I found pictures of him and his girlfriend on a mutual friend's account and the rest was history. His girlfriend and I eventually dumped him. If I didn't see those posts, I wouldn't have known I was being too so because of this incident, I believe that publicly posting about your bae or having your bae post about you is beneficial in that sense. On the other hand, I once dated a man who I loved so deeply and we had an amazing relationship. We shared our best times together on social media. But when we both grew apart and decided to go our separate ways, it was heart-wrenching to go back and remove all those pictures that were part of my life. I knew it had to be done though in order to move forward. With this lesson, I've learned that posting about my bae on social media wasn't the best decision after all. However, love is all about taking risks. So having gone through both experiences, I still wonder if it's a good idea to share your partner with the world. What are your thoughts? Comment below and let me know what you think. If you'd like me to make more of these videos, be sure to subscribe, smash the like button, and hit the notification bell so it'll keep me motivated. Also, check out the link in the description box below of my favorite books on relationships, and hopefully these can help you like they did for me. Thanks for watching and have a great one.